Weather Words is a production of The Reporter, Delaware County's leading news source. Good day to everyone. And here we are. It's Thursday. And I forget the date. I think it's the 13th. Yes. And we've been lucky where I'm standing right now. Not everyone has been. The last several days, they've issued things across the TV, severe watch and severe warning. And right here, we haven't gotten it. It's been hot. It's been humid. It's been miserable when the sun came out. But you know what? I'll take that over what some people have had. I brought something up to the upper field here today. Notice I have a branch down on one of my big maple trees. It fell down and I never even heard it. So the winds we had yesterday actually did it because I was for sure we were going to get something. We had updrafts. That's when you look at the tree leaves and they're all turned backwards like this. And then the wind started to blow and there was a little bit of coolness to it. I said, okay, something's coming. And then across the TV, I went in and looked and they issued a warning. It was for Andes, Hamden, the campgrounds up at Bear Spring Mountain, over toward Delhi, and they were talking about severe winds, they were talking about hail, they were talking about everything, and I said, okay, it missed us, not by much, but you might remember last week when I spoke to you, or it was last Monday, we got nothing, and people had trees down and snapped off and everything else. That still exists today, okay? There's a cold front over us this afternoon, into the evening, and maybe into tonight. There's that chance again. I'd much rather have them say, it's going to rain, because then it's all spread out. The problem with what's coming is, you get a patch of storms here, and then there's nothing, and there's another one there. When they're broken up like that, that's where you get the hail and you get the winds and you possibly, they even said today, oh, we can't rule out a tornado. And I want to say, wonderful, let's throw everything else and see what happens. Because I keep my fingers crossed and I'm still going to get nothing. <laughs> but you don't know anymore. These scattered storms are the ones that build the strength. When they're all spread out in a line like this, it's sort of sharing the energy. When you get the small pieces, those are the ones that develop. And that's gonna be the case for tonight. So we'll have to wait and see. You might get it, I might get nothing. I might get a horrible downpour. In fact, they still have a flood warning, or watch over us anyway. Cause they say, if you get one, you're gonna get it. If you read the paper, you saw the title for my article this week was, some got drenched and some didn't. And that's exactly what's been happening. You can be five miles from here and there's puddles every place and it poured like crazy and right here it's dry. Over in Bainbridge, they got nothing. So, I mean, it's just one of those. Can you predict it? No. So just be ready just in case. What is going to be happening, unfortunately, is this hot, humid weather is going to continue probably for another week. But you know what? I'll take this over the people that are now into their 10th and 11th day of over 110. And there's about 16 states where it's gone over that and it's terrible. And they're actually gonna break a record because what's predicted for them is eight more days of that. And they'll set a new record for the most time it's been over 110. I can't even imagine. That's where you go from air conditioning to air conditioning. You try not to step outside. Feel sorry for all the people whose jobs are outdoors because you know what? That's your job. So just be wary about what's coming do prepared for if the sun comes out, believe it or not, we don't want it today. Because if the sun comes out, it's gonna create instability in the atmosphere. And that's what helps make these storms. So if we stay cloudy, I'll take it. We'll have to wait and see what happens. So good luck to everybody, and hopefully you don't get it. But I only predict I can't make it happen. So we'll see what happens. Have a good one. To subscribe or advertise, call 607-464-4009.